Okay, a little less swearing and a good old fashioned, probably from my dad, slotted screwdriver. I was able to hold the screw in place and get it started so that we're firmly in place. This is not going to go anywhere right now. And we talked originally about the black wire and the white wire and the ground wire from, from the outlet. That's these three wires right here. There's our black, white, our black, and our ground. And on our remote here, we have our black and our white. And then again, these will hook up to the fan. Now what I like to do is lift the fan in place, even with all this extra wire hanging on it. I like to get it up here and make a dry run that make sure that she's fitting okay. Again, in, now remember, clunk. In, clunk. It's not going anywhere. Right, that's very, very important. The next thing I want to do, since I'm going to run this remote in this way, I have my wires that these three hook up to on this side, which is what I want. The remote, this is the little antenna. The remote will fit in place like that. Now here are my black and my white. And here are my black and my white from the main electric. My green is my ground. Now this ground up here is a bare copper wire. Now I have to go get my wire strippers. We'll cut these down shorter and then go ahead and hook up. So we're almost ready to hook up our electricity. Now what did I forget? I forgot this. All right. This has to sit down on top of the fan until I get all the wires hooked up. So easy, easy solve. I take my remote out again. I lift my fan up and out. I bring it down here. Basically, we're going to have to take this out again. So it was just something that I forgot about in our original um, discussion about this. So I need my Phillips screwdriver. It's real simple. Loosen. Loosen. Take our cotter pin out. Pull out our, our, our pin, back through all the wiring, the cup that hides the hanger bracket first, and I should have known better. I guess we could call this a review. Our wires back through our, our down rod. Lift this up so we can see a little better now, that's all. Probably the first time around without having that on there probably helped us to see. Here's our pin again. Kind of have to wiggle a little bit to get it through. There she comes. Put the cotter pin back on so it doesn't come out. Take our screwdriver or Phillips, tighten, tighten up our down rod screws. Now, you can admonish me for not looking at the directions, and I would have probably remembered that if I'd looked at the directions. I don't like everybody else. I kind of like to try to 
do it in a hurry. I'm back. I'm clunk into place. Let's slide that remote back through there again now. Okay. A little sidetrack, but again, we're in good shape. Remote's in place. Our black and our white and our other three are right here. Now, these are my wire cutters and wire strippers. And if you're not familiar with them, we did a little video on them not long ago about how nice they are to have to cut the wire and make the ends bare without having to use a knife. I also have the wire nuts that we need to use to enclose everything up there. Now when you cut off wire, you don't want to be too long or too short. Now I have these three ends sticking out over here for the fan and they're about four or five inches long. Now I'm going to cut these a little longer. I'm going to cut them about here so I have some flexibility to put the ends together. I can cut all three at one time, which I'll do. And then just as a review here, I'm going to strip the end so I can make it um, bare. Now this I happen to know is a 14 and if I put it in my stripper, it takes the end off because primarily all it's doing is cutting the insulation and I need about all oh, three quarters to one inch which is about what I have here so what I'll do on all three of those wires up there is strip the ends like that now my ends up above on the remote are already stripped and again because it's hard to see up there I'll be putting the, the light colors together, but what you may want to make sure before you put the wire nut on is you twist the wires together. See how I did that? All right, you want to do that. Now, of course, up above, I'm going to do what? Blue to blue, black to black, 